the area of a triangle is calculated by using the base, the measurement of the base, and the measurement of the height. The area of a triangle equals a base times the height divided by 2. And the reason why uh, you get that formula is a, tri is a triangle is half a rectangle. So if I have the base of a rectangle and the height of a rectangle, the area of the rectangle is base times height. And a triangle is half of that. So you half the base times the height. Now sometimes a triangle doesn't look like it's half of a rectangle. The triangle might like, look like that. But in actual fact it's still half of a rectangle. So we still take the base and we can still take the height, but it's important that you get the perpendicular height, the height straight up from the base. It doesn't matter which bit of the base, which side that you use as the base, so a triangle might be slightly on its side, you could use this base, so the base is now this length, but then I need to use the corresponding perpendicular height, which would then be that height. So base times height divided by 2 would give me the area of that triangle. If I had a triangle that was over on its side this way, again I could use that base, in which case I would need to use that height, or I could use this base, in which case I'm going to use this height, which is the perpendicular height, going this way. So at 90 degrees to the base. So it's really important that you use the correct measurements. So you're looking for a base, and then you're looking for the perpendicular height. So it's a height that goes at 90 degrees to that line, up to the top of the triangle. And remember, the reason why you were doing that, this was the base, is you are turning the triangle into the corresponding rectangle, that's the base, that's the height, and then you're halving it, so it's half of the rectangle.